that's not intimidating at all. No, it's only the biggest show we've ever had. On August 8th, at 8 p.m. and eight minutes after the hour, we had 111 people in this room. Hopefully, they're all wearing deodorant. Because if they're not, really, internet, you have made a good decision by staying home. Okay, before we really roll, I want to go ahead and crush a rumor mill that's been going around. A lot of people have been asking what I was up to last Friday. Where's Clifton? Right here. That one. Clifton knows, so we're going to talk about it. Um, last Friday, I auditioned for Ringling Brothers. And so did my buddy Clifton. And we both kicked a whole bunch of ass. I actually got some notes on both of us that I will talk to you about later, because I had a friend. One of the things that happened is the Clown Alley was there, and they gave us some amazing feedback. I wanted to take a minute and say that it was the most amazing experience of my life. I learned more in a two-hour audition than I have anywhere else I've gone except for one place, and that's here in this community. Five years ago, I started trying to get myself together. And four years ago, I found this place. When I found you guys, I had 12 inches more around my waist. I weighed 75 pounds more, and I didn't even know how to juggle. And last weekend, because of what this community raised me up to being able to do, I auditioned in front of the greatest show on earth, and they didn't think I sucked. I, I promise you later tonight, during that portion of the show that all these new people don't know about yet, that we'll talk about a little more later. Yes, them. Um, I will tell you some really off-color stories about it. Some embarrassing, terrible, tragic stories, and some amazing stories. But I just wanted to thank everybody here who's been here since the beginning and been here a part of it. When they kept telling me, get your head up, get your head up. It, you know, it's at the base of American Airlines Stadium, and you're trying to look at the top of the stadium, and, and you're shaking, and you're trying to do this amazing thing. And I kept looking up and trying to convince myself there was something in the audience to look at, and I saw you guys. Thank you. It was the most mind-blowing experience. And I figure, we love you too, all of us, everybody. With a crew like this, with all the things we've done, I mean, really, TJ, what could possibly go wrong at this point in the show? It's, it's... Okay, TJ, that's not even funny. What the... Does anyone remember Mia Taste of Dallas? Oh, crap. Okay, um, uh, okay, so that happened. <laughs> <laughs>